Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 8 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about Livewire file upload. So let's see how can we upload file in Livewire. So first of all, let's create a model. So switch to the command prompt. And for creating the model, just write here the command php artisan make colon model and model name. Now let's say model name is upload. And also create the migration. So just write here dash m and now press enter now switch to the project and just go inside the database directory then migration and from here just open create upload table migration and inside this migration let's add some column here so just write here dollar table the string and column name uh, let's say column name is title add here the another column table string and column name file name all right now save this file and now uh, just open the upload model so just go inside the app directory then models and from here just open upload.php file so inside this model file let's add here the table name so let's write here protected dollar table is equal to table name which is uploads and also add the fillable column so just write here protected dollar label and inside the array just add here the column name so just write here title and uh, file name all right now save this file now let's migrate this migration so switch to the command prompt and uh, just type here the command php artisan migrate Alright, migration complete. Now let's create a live wire component. So for that, just write here php artisan make colon live wire space component name. Uh, let's say component name is uploads and now press enter. Component created. Now run the application. So just write here php artisan serve. Now switch to the project. Now let's create the route for the component, upload component. So just go inside the routes directory, then wave.php, and uh, here uh, just write here route get and add here the URI. Let's see URI is uploads and component class name. So just write here uploads and also add here the class file path. All right, components class uh, file path. All right, and uh, colon colon class. All right, now save this file, and now just open the component view file. So just go inside the resources directory, then views and the live wire, and from here just open upload dot uploads dot play dot php file, and inside this file let's create a form here. So uh, I have already added the bootstrap CDN inside the default layout file. You can see here. Alright. Now inside this uploads uh, component view file, just add here a section. And uh, after section, just add here container. And then row, column, md, sec and also add here the offset and the 3 and inside this just add here card then card header and inside this just add here the heading uh, file upload all right now card body and inside this card body uh, let's create a form so just write here form tag and also set the id so just write here form as upload and ink type multi-part form data and inside this form uh, let's create uh, the input text field and file uh, input file field so 
first of all just right here form dash group and then label label for title and just add here the text title all right now input type is equal to text and uh, name title all right and also add here the class form as control now just copy this and paste here now change here the text or file and here input type file all right just change here the name file name all right and also here file name now just add here the submit button so just write here button type is equal to submit and the class btn btn dash success and also dot write all right and just write here a text of long. now save this file and uh, let's check this form so switch to the browser and just go to the url slash uploads and here you can see the form uh, let's uh, give some padding on top so inside the section just add a style padding top uh, let us see the pixel. All right, now save this file and refresh the page. All right, now looking good. Now uh, just open the upload uh, component class file. So just go inside the app directory, then HTTP LiveWire, and from here just open uploads.php. Set this component class file. Uh, let's create two properties. So just write here public dollar title and second property public dollar file name. All right. And now let's bind this property with uh, this in uh, form control. So just write here inside the this input text field wire model equal to property name which is title and inside this input file uh, input type file let's write here wire model is equal to file name all right now save this file now inside the component class file uh, let's create a function here so let's write here public function and function name and let's say function name is file upload and inside this function uh, first of all validate the input field so on the right here dollar validated data is equal to dollar this arrow call here the validate function and inside this is pass here an array and inside this array, the right here the following uh, field name, title, and uh, add here the validation required. All right, and for the file name, also required. All right, and after this. We just write here file name is equal to dollar this arrow file name and uh, just call here the store function store and inside this inside the first parameter just write here files and the second parameter okay. all right and after this dot uh, dollar validated data and inside this inside here the key name file name 
is equal to dollar file name this one all right so this right here file name and after this load colon colon create and inside this this pass here this validated data all right so this right here dollar validated data and also import this model upload model so this right here use and uh, f slash models slash upload all right and now just add here station and slash and inside this just to set here the key message and add here the message file successfully uploaded all right and after this just reset the form so for that just write here dollar this it and generate an event so just write here file uploaded all right and uh, now one more thing just add here use live wire slash with file uploads all right and uh, just before this function just write here use with file upload all right now save this file now inside this uploads uh, component view file just uh, display here the validation error message so for that just write here uh, error directive so just write here add the rate error and inside this add here the name title and name span class text danger and then add this span just print here the message dollar message and now just close the error directive so just right here add the print error all right now just copy this and paste inside this input type file after this and change here the name file name all right now save this file now let's uh, call this function on submit event so for that inside this form just write here wire colon uh, submit dot prevent is equal to function name okay that is file upload so just copy and paste here all right and uh, also display the session uh, this message inside this component view file so just before this uh, uh, before this card i'm just going to print here uh, so just write here at the rate if if directive and inside this just write your station and uh, here the message key so just write here as the key name which is this one message okay so just copy and paste here and uh, take this then uh, we'll just print this div class alert alert to dash success inside this just print here the station and inside this just write here the key name message all right and just add in here the if directive so just write here in if all right now this file 
now it's done now just handle this event file uploaded so just go inside the layout file so just uh, just go inside the uh, layouts folder and then open app.blade.php file this is the layout file and inside this script tag uh, just right here I'm just going to copy this and uh, paste here and now just copy this file uploaded and uh, paste here and inside this just reset the form so for that, uh, for that just write here dollar and uh, has and just add here the form id which is uh, this one file form dash upload okay now just copy and paste here and then zero and just call the reset function will reset all right it will reset the form now save this file uh, file and uh, all done so let's check this so switch to the browser and uh, just refresh the page now just click on upload and you can see here the validation error all right now just enter the uh, title here uh, let's say first file all right and now choose the file I'm just going to select this one and open. Now click on upload. And you can see here the message file successfully uploaded. Alright, now let's check this file. So uh, just go inside the project, direct, uh, project directory and uh, now just click on stories tab uh, then public and uh, inside the files you can see here the image all right now let's check inside the database so uh, inside the new tab just open php my admin now just open the database lara will live live wire db this is the database and then upload stable just click on browse and here you can see the title and file name all right this is the title and file name all right now uh, let's upload another file so just refresh the page and uh, just add here the title second file and uh, select file here and now just click on submit upload and the file uploaded uh, let's check inside the database so just refresh the uh, table and here you can see the second file and this is the file name All right now let's check inside the directory and here you can see the image all right so in this way you can upload the file uh, in LiveWire. So that's all about LiveWire file upload. So thanks for watching this video. And if you still have any kind of question, you can ask me in the comment box. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.